Today we're going to subtract mis mixed fractions using the arrow method. So if we look at our problem, we have 4 and 1 7th minus 2 and 4 7th. So what we practice in class is subtracting the whole numbers first. Subtracting 4 minus 2 and that would be 2. Then we keep the fractions where they are. So 1 7th is going to stay right there minus 4 seventh. From here, we use our arrow method and use our number bond to break apart 4 sevenths to get to a whole number. So what I mean by that is if I look at 2 and 1 seventh, I want to get myself to 2. So I would have to subtract 1 seventh. So I'm going to pull out 1 seventh from 4 sevenths and I would have left 3 sevenths. 1 seventh plus 3 sevenths equals 4 sevenths. So now when I do my subtraction, I can use my arrow method. 2 and 1 seventh minus 1 seventh equals 2. And now I'm going to subtract the other number in my number bond. I've done 1 seventh, so now I need to do 3 sevenths. So 2 minus 3 sevenths. Now here it's a tricky part. Um, we have to think about what the fraction is that would get us to one whole in working with sevenths. And we've learned that the bottom number has to be the same as the top. So seven sevenths equals one whole. So in my head, I'm going to think seven sevenths minus three sevenths. And that would be four sevenths. And because we subtracted and we've gone back one whole, I'm not at two holes anymore, I'm now in one hole.